Hi everyone, this is Sam at Hunter's Design Studio with another video of what do you need to know about this pattern. So today's pattern is Carpe Nap. Uh, this is a two size pattern. We have the big one here at 55 by 70 inches. So a nice big snuggle size, which makes it appropriate for its message. The pattern also includes a little one, a crib size. Um, and this guy is about 40 inches uh, by 44 inches. So that's what the little one looks like. So this would be really great for a crib or a baby quilt. So what do we need to know about this pattern? These letters are not foundation paper piece. They are actually classically pieced. They are strips, rectangles, and squares. We make our diagonal edges with the snowball technique, the technique whereby you sew a square on, sew across the diagonal and flip it out so you don't have any tricky templates here. It goes together in big chunks, make letters, make the piece that goes in between, um, put them together in strips, and off we go. The little quilt doesn't have the Z's on the bottom. Um, I, I specced it out, they were kind of a really, really fussy size to make. So we decided not to put them into the little quilt. But the big quilt has these great Z's. Again, this is made with snowballs and little strips. So this is just fun. Um, I don't know about you, but I don't know too many grown-ups that don't enjoy a really good nap. And I thought it might be fun to uh, play with those words and seize the nap. Anyway, if you have any questions about this pattern or any other, get a hold of me through the contact page on my website, which is huntersdesignstudio.com, and I'll answer your questions for you. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.